This is the uh, Federal Model 5 Siren located in East Granby, right next to the uh, ambulance and right across is the uh, fire department. This siren's been inactive since 2014, 10 years ago, and hasn't been fixed since. And um, there is actually a reason why the siren's inactive, and I'll tell you all. So I talked to the fire chiefs uh, two years ago, back in March. I asked any reason why it's inactive. So, for what I'm told, um, it was like 11 o'clock at night on a winter storm, 11 o'clock p.m. at night, the siren went off and it's been going off on attack mode for about 15 minutes and they couldn't shut it off. So, they have to go in the control box to shut it off and that's it, it hasn't, hasn't gone off since. So. So yeah, the last time it was sound, from what I'm told, was back in 2014, which was 10 years ago. So yeah, 10 years, the siren has been inactive. And yeah, the siren, yeah, it looks like it could be used for maintenance work. And uh, I don't think it should be a problem if I go over here just for a little, just, just as a close up. Yeah, you can see this control box is busted up real good. Oh my god, it scared me. Oh yeah, this this control box is busted. Oh yeah, it is. Yeah, this thing is cooked. So, uh, yeah, for what I'm told, um, I don't think they have any plans on uh, fixing the siren and it just shows me that it looks like the siren won't be uh, turned back on anytime in the future but from what I'm told um, the siren won't go anywhere unless if unless the siren falls off because this thing looks like it's tilted pretty badly a little bit so so uh, figure I do a very quick tour of this inactive siren like I said, this is located in East Granby, located next to the ambulance. And right across from there is the uh, East Granby Fire Department. So yeah, like I said, the last time the siren was sound was back in sometime in the winter of 2014. I guess it could have been February or March. But um, yeah, this thing has been inactive since 10 years ago, 2014, and it hasn't sound since. So it's a pretty shame that the siren is inactive. And also, I figured I should mention this, uh, East Granby does have another siren, not too far from the road. Um, it's a federal free T22 siren, which has also been inactive, I think, for a long time now, since I think, if I recall, 2008, um, I heard it got was struck by lightning or just needs uh, maintenance work, but yeah. This siren is inactive, and another siren, uh, Free T22, is also inactive. So both sirens are inactive, and something tells me that I don't think they have any plans on fixing these sirens for... I don't think they're going to bother anyway. I think it's just a lot a lot of money to put into it, so I don't think it's worth their time to do it. But um, as long as the siren is still staying around, I'm happy, and... um. But if the siren does go away in the future, I'd be sad because I do like looking at the siren from time to time. So uh, I figured I'd do a very quick tour of this uh, the siren, and uh, thanks for watching.